Hi everyone, this is Jimmy from BioLight, and in front of you is F90 Fito monitor. The screen is 12.1 inch color TFT LCD. Resolution is 800 times 600 pixels. 12 crystal IPX1 waterproof pro. Built-in large capability rechargeable lithium ion battery. Built-in Z fold paper thermal printer with adjustable tracing speed. Built-in CTG analysis system. Multiple display interface can be easily switched. The first port is ultrasonic triple sensor connect. The second port is fetal heart rate second sensor connector. And third port is fetus weaker connector. Right side of the machine, we have temperature connector, an IPP connector, SPO2 connector and ECG connector. We have an IPP measurement button, a lamp pause acknowledgement button. We have fetal heart rate 1 and fetal heart rate 2 switch button. And also we have clinical event marking button. And we have toco reset button. Last is the print button. When we go to main button, we will be able to choose different screen layout. We have fetal screen. And we can select fetal heart rate 1 and fetal heart rate 2 to be displayed at the same time. We have uterine contraction and we have fetal movement. And for fetal movement, we can choose either manual or either auto. And we can choose fetal casket. And choose big fetal numeric display. Next will be fetal and maternal. And also we can see ECG waveforms, SPO2 and respiration waveforms. You can choose big numeric display for fetal and maternal. And one more we have maternal screen. When we go to review function, you will be able to see patient list, CTG waveforms, an IVP, train data, alarm events, and we have CTG score. And for CTG storage, we can support up to 120 hours. Professional CTG analysis system provide reliable reference for clinicians. We need to record fetal movement manually. We need to let the examiner to hold the fetal movement button connected to the instrument. Once the examiner press once, the fetal monitor will detect one fetal movement. And when I press one more time, it will be recorded as well. So on the screen, you will be able to see the fetal movement. This is fetal movement button. This is ultrasound transducer. This is contraction transducer. This is SPO2 prop. And we can see SPO2 level is 98%. Blood pressure is 118 over 75. This is 5 lead ECG. Once I apply ECG leads onto the patient's body, I'm able to see waveforms, 
screen straight away. 